Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction, let us show you the way. Stool acidity test first, avoid milk and lactose containing foods for several days. Then on a free morning, such as a Saturday, drink two large glasses of skim or low-fat milk, 14 to 16 ounces. If symptoms develop within four hours, the diagnosis of lactose intolerance is fairly certain. Make your mark, take our lead. Without lactase, the body can't properly digest food that has lactose in it. This means that if you eat dairy foods, the lactose from these foods will pass into your intestine, which can lead to gas, cramps, a bloated feeling, and diarrhea, say, diarrhea, which is loose, watery poop. Take our lead. A physician will take a stool sample to see if lactose is breaking down properly in the system. Fermenting lactose in the intestines, a sign of lactose intolerance, creates lactic acid, which can be detected in stool. These tests may be performed in your physician's office or in an outpatient laboratory. Take our lead. Lactic acid bacteria, lab, such as Lactobacillus acidophilus and Lactobacillus bulgaricus may help digesting lactose contained in fermented dairy products and this could be beneficial to individuals suffering from lactose intolerance. Let's help you make your mark. Small intestine people with lactose intolerance are unable to fully digest the sugar, lactose, in milk. As a result, they have diarrhea, gas and bloating after eating or drinking dairy products. The condition, which is also called lactose malabsorption, is usually harmless, but its symptoms can be uncomfortable. Let's help you make your mark. There isn't a cure for lactose intolerance and no known way to make your body produce more lactase. But you can manage it if you limit your consumption of dairy products, eat lactose-reduced food, or take an over-the-counter lactase supplement. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.